If any of you have seen the 2009 Nicolas Cage movie The Knowing, you would be totally against opening up time capsules with the fear that something could go massively wrong. Honestly, that movie scared me as a kid. Who else was spooked by it? Hey everyone, welcome back to Most Amazing Top 10 and welcome to today's video. I'm your host, Lindsay Ivan, and today I'm bringing you the top 10 mysterious time capsules that shouldn't be opened. Now, what happens if they are opened? Will it be a Pandora's box type situation? No one knows, and let's keep it that way. Starting off in our 10th spot, we have the capsules of ancient Egypt. Now, ancient Egypt is known for having several unexplored tombs, tunnels, and crypts. Now, the crypts themselves are often referred to as time capsules because of all the hidden artifacts preserved inside. Other people believe that there are tons of time capsules hidden throughout ancient Egypt, although they wouldn't be the typical ones that we have today. They believe that these would contain artifacts and scrolls that could give us more information on ancient Egypt. However, people believe that if you open these capsules, then you will be subject to an ancient Egyptian curse, or that you will trigger some sort of booby trap and be killed in the process. Other people believe that if you don't open the capsules correctly, then it could completely destroy the artifacts inside. It's frustrating because these capsules could help us learn more about ancient Egypt, but at the same time, nobody wants to be cursed. Moving on at number 9, we have the mysterious time capsule at the Washington Monument. Now, during construction of the Washington Monument, workers discovered a mysterious time capsule. They said that this time capsule was over a hundred years old. The capsule was found behind a bronze plaque that had September 12, 1915 engraved on it. People believe that that was roughly the time that the capsule was placed there. Now, no one knows who made this capsule or why it was there. It still remains a huge mystery to this day. Now, many people didn't want to open the capsule, fearing that it may destroy the contents. But they didn't listen, and a year later it was opened. Thankfully, none of the contents were destroyed. Now, I know I technically like cheated with this one because they opened it, but this story was too interesting to not include. Like, they still don't know who put it there. In the capsule, there was a copy of George Washington's second inaugural address, a glass bottle with his portrait, and some coins. So, did somebody put it there on behalf of George Washington, or what? Mystery remains. At number 8, we have the refrigerator capsules. Now, in 1939, Westington House filled a capsule with hundreds of items. Some items included alarm clocks, hats, and alphabet blocks. Now, a man named Wayne Donaldson was inspired by that and in the 60s decided to fill a refrigerator and bury it on a hill. A bunch of other individuals followed in his lead and also did this. Apparently, using a fridge worked really well because it kept bugs out and preserved the items. Now, Wayne decided to put items such as a lava lamp, photos, and hit records in the fridge. All of these individuals plan to dig up their fridge when they are 80. But seriously, hold on one second. Fridges are expensive and they would be a hassle to bury. So you won't catch me doing that. Now, there is a conspiracy that some other people have buried some fridges of their own. But these fridges won't contain lava lamps. Instead, they believe that it may contain dead bodies. In our seventh spot, we have the photograph time capsule. Now, this next story was posted by a Reddit user. Although I'm not sure of its validity, it was too good to not include in this video. So, this user said that 20 years ago, him and his four childhood friends made and buried time capsules. Now, they almost forgot about their time capsules, but eventually they remembered and dug them up when they were around 30. But when they dug it up, the user found something more terrifying. Now, in his capsule, he originally placed two medals, a $5 bill, and a Charmander Pokemon card. However, all that he found in his time capsules were photos. Now, he really should not have opened this capsule. Each photo was of him at a different stage of his life, and it was labeled. The first photo was of him at his father's funeral. The caption wrote, soon you will wish you could join your father. Another photo was at his graduation. The person that took this photo is said to be Karma. Now, this is quite scary because he doesn't know who had been taking these photos of him and how it got inside the time capsule. Now, this story may be fake, but people believe that it was the user from a parallel universe contacting himself. One thing for sure is that this Reddit user wishes that he listened to his instinct that told him to not open the capsule. Coming in at number 6, we have the Expo 70 time capsule. Now, this time capsule was created by Panasonic and the Manichi newspaper. They wanted to create two time capsules that preserved life life and heritage. Now, the lower time capsule is going to remain buried for another 5,000 more years. The upper capsule was opened in 2000 and another would be opened every 100 years. Now, each capsule is said to contain 2,098 objects. 
a lot of the objects in the capsules are still unknown. However, some have reported items such as false teeth, handcuffs, a glass eye, and insects and resin. Like seriously, what a random mixture of things. But what are the other items in the capsules? Well, I don't think we'll be alive to get the answer to that question. But hey, if you're watching this video in the year 6000, then comment down below. We are now at our fifth and halfway mark with the largest axe in the world. Now let's make our way to my country Canada. In New Brunswick, a giant axe monument was constructed. This was to commemorate the importance of the lumber and forestry business. Honestly, this is one of the most Canadian things, I swear. Now this axe is huge. It is made out of 55 tons of steel. It's 23 feet in length and the handle extends about 50 feet in the air. It's massive. Now apparently there is a time capsule hidden in the axe head and people believe that it will never be discovered. Seriously, what do they have to hide? Why would they put a time capsule somewhere that can't be accessed? And I don't think anyone is going to destroy this monument, so it's safe to say that we will never know Canada's secret. But honestly, it makes me think what other monuments have time capsules inside of them? Maybe the Statue of Liberty? Who knows? But knowing Canada is probably just something like a maple syrup recipe or how to make the best poutine, I don't know. At number four, we have the haunted capsule. Now, this is another story posted on Reddit. What's freaky is I ended up writing about this and then I went back to the page and it no longer existed, so I don't even know. So on January 20th, 2018, this user and his friend found a time capsule while using a metal detector out in the forest. The time capsule had please don't open written on the lid. His friend really wanted to open it, but the user got a bad vibe from it. He even said that when he touched the capsule to open the lid, he felt cold all of a sudden and his vision went dark for a bit. Now, the friend ended up taking the capsule home, but immediately regretted it. He said that the whole night he felt like someone was watching him. The next day, they went back and reburied the time capsule. But they still don't know who put it there, why, and what's inside. Honestly, I'm just glad that they didn't open it. Like, it probably would have just unleashed some sort of demon. Sounds like a good basis for a scary movie, though. Coming in at number three, we have the Crypt of Civilization. Now, this chamber was built from 1937 to 1940. And you heard correctly, it's a whole dang chamber, not just a tiny capsule. It's a full 2,000 cubic foot room filled with documents and artifacts. Now, you're not allowed to open the chamber for around another 6,000 years. So, the purpose of the chamber is actually terrifying. It is said to be compiled with knowledge and other contents to preserve our way of life in case of mass extinction. So this room contains items such as 800 works of every subject, historical recordings, and items to show our technological advancements like typewriters. There are other random items like pantyhose and a figurine of Donald Duck, you know, the important stuff. There's also a device that will instruct those who find the chamber to learn how to speak English. Now, people believe that this was made because humanity won't live much longer. They think that another species will dominate or that the government has some sort of sinister plan to deal with overpopulation. This chamber will hold the last memories of the human race. But seriously, imagine finding this chamber and seeing pantyhose. Like, I wouldn't know what they're for. Like, putting them on my legs would be the last thing I would do. Next up at number two, we have Franklin Roosevelt's time capsule. Franklin D. Roosevelt was the 32nd president of the United States. Now, in 1940, Mr. Roosevelt buried a 450 pound time capsule, which is said to be opened in 2040. That's right, this thing is massive. But oddly enough, no one knows what is actually in there. Seems hard to believe that the president was able to bury a huge time capsule with no one even questioning it. When researching, there's hardly any information on it. And people believe that that's for a reason. People think that what the capsule contains poses a threat to national security and should never be opened. They fear that it will reveal harmful government secrets. Other people hope that it will have the frozen president himself in there which wouldn't make that much sense if he was still alive when it was buried. But all we can do is make assumptions and hope that nothing bad happens when it's opened in 20 years. And in our number one spot, we have the Richard Nixon time capsule. Now, Richard Nixon was the 37th president of the United States and was said to have hidden a time capsule 
in the White House. What does this capsule contain, you ask? Well, according to Earl Robert Merritt, Richard confided in him that it contains proof of extraterrestrials. Now, some people don't believe Earl and question his credibility, but he swears that the president met with him in secret and read him a letter stating that the US was protecting extraterrestrials. He also claims that scientists were conducting experiments and communicating with them. Now, the location of this time capsule is still unknown. Only a handful of people know where it's hidden. However, Nixon claimed that it will surface when the time is right. Uh, what do you think? Are aliens real? Will this time capsule expose the US government? What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. And that's it for today's video, let's move on to our comment shout out portion. I'll be shouting out comments from my video top 10 scary Paw Patrol theories. Myrna Resendez commented, ah yes, overthinking kid shows, my favorite kind of theories. Same here. It's crazy what people come up with and how they manage to turn everything dark. Awesome friend commented, can you do Malcolm in the Middle? I like seeing my favorite shows having theories. Wow, Malcolm in the Middle was a great show. I'd always do that whole like, you know, life is unfair thing with the, I would just copy it at the beginning of the opening. Love that show. Watching it now, I realize that it wasn't appropriate for kids. Not at all. Legalized Homicide commented, I grew up with Courage the Cowardly Dog, Cat Dog, and South Park. First off, I don't agree with your YouTube name. And secondly, honestly, Courage the Cowardly Dog was terrifying. How was it a kid show? It gave me nightmares. But uh, comment down below what show I should do scary theories on next. Well, that's all the comments I'm shouting out for today. Don't forget to comment down below something for a chance to be featured in my next comment shout out. And as always, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to Most Amazing Top 10 for more amazing videos. I've been your host, Lindsay Ivan, and I'll see you when I see you. Two medals, a five dollar bill, and a Charmander Pokemon card. 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 Now, this time capsule was created by Panasonic and the Man Manichi. They wanted to create two time capsules that preserved life. Now, the lower capsule is going to be buried for another five thousand more years. Now, the lower time. Ca now, the lower. Now the lower time capsule is going to bury. Oh my gosh! Now the lower time capsule is going to be buried for another. Now the lower time capsule is going to be buried for. It's going to remain buried.